Hi, Larry WD0 AKX, and in this video, I'd kind of like to promote a friend of mine's website, uh, ToddFun.com. He has a lot of interesting projects on there, and one of them is a frequency counter for a TS520S, a Kenwood uh, radio, uh, with an analog display, and he, uh, he has built up a project uh, using an Arduino to uh, make a frequency display for this radio. This is his homepage at toddfun.com and you can see the Arduino project there, the frequency counter for the Kenwood radio and some other videos and on the right side of the page he has a listing of archives, a lot of other projects and videos that you might want to check out. I'll leave a link down below there to his website toddfun.com. He's also on YouTube but he has a lot of cool projects on the site. So you might like to check his page out and uh, basically for one of his projects he used me as an experimental station to talk to. I'm in Minnesota and he's in Arizona. He went over to his buddy Steve's ham shack and uh, used his frequency counter on his Kenwood TS520S radio and we just talked back and forth. He kind of verified his frequency display a little bit that way. So the rest of this video uh, that's what you're going to see things from my end here, just talking to him in HF Contact, Arizona. But if you want to see the complete project and uh, his end of things, which is pretty interesting, uh, check out his page. So let's take a look here. KB7, KWK. Uh, good evening, Steve. The WD0AKX here. QSL, uh, right now I am at uh, 7.254.55 here. Okay, I got you pretty good right now. I, I talked to the tech the other day and uh, I like to read up a little bit of an alignment. So, uh, my buddy Steve will be uh, checking that out. So, I'll be right back with you. Thank you. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and check it out. Yeah, it's uh, a little bit of 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 a Increasing here a little bit, so the copy is pretty good right now. Okay, and I'm using an off-center fed uh, dipole here right now, and uh, 100 watts using my uh, Yesu FT847, over. Alright, well, uh, I haven't, uh, I haven't tried to give it my phone in a long time. The uh, Colt kind of donated me a Yesu 857D, so that's the uh, radio I've been playing with mostly. So, um, I think it's a thing out and let it warm up, you know how that goes. Yeah, they take a little while to warm up there, so I understand that. Uh, I have a Drake TR4CW sitting over here, and that takes me a good half an hour to warm that thing up. So, uh, anyhow, uh, conditions are definitely a little better than the other night when we tried it. Go ahead. Yeah, I'll do that. Well, <laughs> you, you never can tell, I guess. So, I was glad that uh, we got you right away here, so that's, uh, that's good. And, uh, Good test on the frequency counter. A nice little box that uh, Todd came up with here, too. So, you know, I'm going to go ahead and hand uh, Todd the mic plate chat at you for a minute, and uh, we'll see how long we want to keep going here. WD0 AKX, this is KB7. I'm going to hand the mic to uh, Todd. Okay, uh, go ahead there, Todd. KF7 NBI, how you doing there tonight, Todd? I'm doing great, Larry. Thanks for helping out with this project. Uh, and it's just been the frequency counter is actually helpful for uh, making contact. I really appreciate that. Um, I'm going to put a link to your, uh, your YouTube channel in this channel, in this uh, video too, uh, so people can check out your video because you're making a video too on this contract. That really helps out too, so people can see how you're turning into us. Uh, it's it's a little bit of work. I'm so glad that we had a team of lenders, 
Bill DeBoer, sir, uh, he has to be thanked for service for the frequency counter. And uh, he did an excellent job. All I had to do was uh, put all the components in it. And, and then, of course, uh, build up a box that held it nice and, nice and secure. So it really worked out great. Um, so back to you, uh, Larry, and um, thanks, uh, thanks very much for helping us out with the KF7 NBI. Okay, Todd, very good. Uh, yeah, that sounds great. Uh, I'll be interested in seeing the final product there and uh, your your video on this uh, device. So it'll be interesting to see. And you have a great channel there. Keep it up. Uh, thanks for the link to my channel here also. So anyhow, I'm hearing you quite well here tonight. Uh, good luck with your project there, Todd. Thanks a lot. Thanks for what you're doing. Okay, we'll talk to you later then, Todd, uh, KF7NBI, and uh, Steve, KB7KWK, in uh, Mesa, Arizona. This is WD0AKX, Elberly, Minnesota.